at that particular time, I had so many balls in, in the air, I felt I was juggling. And for the first time in my career, I thought I'm going to drop one of these because I can't suss them out to get them in order to how I cope with them. The main surprise was how uh, focused and um, insightful the mentorship that Elizabeth gave us was virtually from day one. Um, I, I always remember when, Elizabeth won't know this, but for the, the moment she walked out of the room after our hour and a half first session, uh, Amy and I sort of looked each other, at each other and said, wow, you know, <laughs> that this is really going to make a difference. It's getting us thinking in a way that's quite different to how we thought before. There are going to be some positive outcomes from this. It's really going to help us shift this organisation, this um, being, if you like, that we had within our town from what it was to what it needs to be. It was really good. I was beginning to feel much more confident that I had now got some new skills, new ways of thinking, that those balls that I was juggling were quite safe now. They weren't quite in order, but they weren't going to drop either. So uh, it was just such a positive experience for me as a leader. Reflecting on what you've done and what you do reminds you of why you're doing it and who you're doing it for. Um, and for me, I've always, from a young age, wanted to impact young people who are struggling and who don't know what direction to go in. And um, my charity mentor enabled me, like Jill said, to have more confidence to reflect and put in place what was working and, and make the difficult changes and in a similar way have those difficult conversations with the chair and with the trustees and say actually I need more help can more of the action points come from you guys instead of me the key is to delegate and you know you utilize the skills of everyone and I think reflecting on everyone's skills and, and using that is important and just getting people to capture the vision your vision their vision will impact things further. My advice to any mentee is to take this opportunity for your own mental health more than anything else actually and it, it builds your resilience and will help you take your charity forward. Make ambitious but realistic targets for yourself. Um, I've looked back on my six month um, <laughs> targets and was actually quite surprised as to how many I've achieved um, or my team has achieved uh, despite them being quite ambitious and that's exciting so I think push yourselves definitely.